It's spring break. It's spring break. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Spring break. Spring break. That's happy thing number one. That is definitely grateful thing number one. It's spring break. And my hair is long enough to do flippy doos. And I love it. And today, we're going to get on here and get back to throwing. Oh, yes. Well, kind of throwing. I got to do some plates, man. And I've researched a couple of different ways to do them. So we're going to explore that. Tim also needs to do plates. So I think you're going to like it. Things are coming, everybody. We are going to get back on the wheel. But first, I am going to roll a nice thick slab um, and see about using the slab roller in conjunction with the wheel um, to get some plates. Uh, Tim, he, we bought uh, a length of PVC pipe we're also going to try throwing plates with a length of PVC pipe. Um, but um, I want to try this method before Tim gets out here because I know he has no desire to try this method. And once he gets out here, we're, we're, we're going to prioritize what he wants to do because he knows it's not here. So, fantastic. That is how I'm spending today. We are learning new ways to do plates, and I hope that you can benefit from it. <laughs> Alright. 
daddy. I'm just gonna go all the way out from the middle. I wonder if you could set the mud to a cracker. And then see it. Whoa! That works really well. Alright, now I'm still feeling some serious wobble down here on the edge. So we're gonna take that off. Oh man, what is that? Just 
kidding. As I was trying to set it down, it flopped really bad. So we're gonna cut it off. I was gonna leave it so that I can work with it, but we're gonna cut it off and just see how my thickness is. Does she need? I need to know if my thickness is okay. And it's not really thick enough. It's okay. Definitely not, not what I'm looking for, not what I'm wanting to see. It is thicker on the bottom than it is on the sides, though. So that's good, and the th sides are a nice, even thickness, which is good. Um, so the question then becomes, is it me working with it too much, probably? Or is it, it? Or is it my slab all? Amazing, and I just realized I have an air bubble in this. It looks great. So, I was trying to decide do I want to try and cut this off or do I not? And what is going to be more satisfying to look at this plate and wonder or to look at this plate and know? And so we are going to look at this plate and know what that means is I've got to cut this sucker off now. All right, watch. You know, I'm wondering if I'm just not strong enough. That, that was an unacceptable pull. But I am wondering if I'm just not strong enough to hold this to the back well enough. So that was not good. This was four pounds of clay. The first one was also four pounds of clay. And this one came together quite nicely. But the last one, the... Um, base was thicker and i'm not now that i'm looking at it i'm not sure that the base was was thicker as much as i didn't get it cut off real good so cutting off is the next but look at all this clay that's still on the wheel there's practically a plate It's the same thickness as what I cut off. I practically cut off half of it. Look at that. That's a lot of clay. Oh, it takes me back to my chocolate curl days. Ooh, maybe we could. Chocolate curls. Chocolate curls are my favorite. Um. Yeah, so I guess that means I need more clay. Maybe four and a half pounds. But four and a half pounds done like this is completely and totally manageable and I can get a beautiful plate out of it. Now, can I get that beautiful plate trimmed? I don't know, maybe, maybe not. But that too was a good consistent 12 inch plate and if you if you don't need a foot on the bottom of your plates, that was completely and totally acceptable. Uh, I need a foot on the bottom of my plates. Since I already have four pounds weighed out and measured up, I'm going to roll a deeper slab first and see how that turns out because more is not always better. Sometimes it's just more. Name that movie. <laughs> It's great. It 
looks really good. It's not quite wide enough, but I think that has to do with the, um, I had to cut, eh, with the thicker bottom, I've got to cut more off before I start actually throwing it. But, I wanted you to see the cut through. So here we go. That is just hard. All right, that is the floor we've been looking for. Fantastic. I almost want to cut it apart. Just, I think I will. I'm going to cut it apart and look at the thickness of the floor and make sure. Yeah. There we go. Look, that'll take a foot. Yay. Yay. Fantastic. All right. Now we are cooking with gas. So that is promising. <laughs> there we go. This looks pretty good. No, it's not perfect, but it looks really, really good. And I got it cut off and everything. <whistles> Love it. And this was four and a half pounds of clay. So four and a half pounds of clay on the slab roller, compressed, put on the bat. We'll see how it dries. Wish me luck. <laughs> Looks like I got two. Everyone wonder what you look like with the nose ring? 